Hello everybody, Photog Nord here, back with another tip for you. Um, today we are going to talk about maintenance of the uh, leather components of your Fuji X100. So we bought this nice uh, Fuji camera and this uh, nice uh, Gordy's strap, all made of leather. And uh, this case is made of leather and we all know when we uh, walk around in the hot sun uh, with our camera equipment, uh, the camera does not like the... Uh, the um, the, uh, the leather casing does not like the sun or the elements very much. Uh, not like us uh, humans or living beings. Uh, skin cells do not uh, reproduce when you have a, a dead case like this, dead cow. So uh, what we need to do is to uh, maintain our pouch. And um, I think you can use almost any sort of leather wax. Uh, I have this. Wonder Balsam uh, that came with um, a pair of Dr. Martin's boots I bought a long time ago. It says uh, waxes that naturally restores, protects, and conditions most most leathers. So, uh, so I got this sponge here, and uh, down in the bottom I got this waxy stuff. And uh, yes, this is very greasy. So um, you will have to. Uh, enjoy a greasy case for a few days or you can just uh, wax it in and uh, let it just sift into the leather uh, for a couple of days and then take your case out to use it uh, I don't do this very often um, I do this uh, maybe once or twice per year and it really does wonders for uh, all sorts of, of leathers you should also do this to your shoes uh, and other leather apparel so uh, what I actually do is just to take the sponge and uh, make sure I have a little uh, wax on here and then I take my case and I uh, just rub it in here just like uh, if you remember the army we did this every night with our boots uh, just good in the stitches here like this don't be afraid to uh, to be a little excessive with the uh, wax, you're only going to do this uh, a couple of times a year. Uh, very nice. Remember to go everywhere, especially the smaller parts that will uh, wear uh, more quickly than the rest of the larger parts. Uh, this, for instance, could very easily uh, get dry in the sun. Uh, and then when it snaps, well, you have to buy an entire new case, and then uh, that's not really cool. Uh, okay, so, uh, and only on the outside, because the inside is not made of leather. It's made of some fake red uh, velour looky looking thing, or velvet, I think it's called. Uh, all right, and uh, you should do the same to your... Uh, if you have a leather strap, you should also apply the uh, the wax here. Don't be afraid to get it all greased in. Um, the leather will uh, suck up some of it and uh, the rest of it will naturally just fall off at some point. Maybe you could just do like this, yep. And. Uh, Take a little more here. Just pull this all the way through the strap. Yeah, it's nice and greasy. Very good. This piece here. Give it a good wax on. Wax off, Daniel san. I think I would make Mr. Miyagi proud. Alright. So, uh, yep, something for the back of the neck here to get greased a bit. So, um, this is of course a YouTube video, so I'm not going to be uh, very uh, uh, precise about this, but you get the point. Just uh, get your Wonder Balsam, get your leather uh, conditioner and uh, grease your leather things in and uh, your equipment will love you for it and it will last you a lot longer than if you do not so uh, but i guess it's all up to you 
Well, uh, thanks for watching this tip and uh, hope to see you soon. Uh, remember to, uh, to like uh, the video if you like it. Uh, see you soon. Bye.